right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today we're going to be talking about how to add a printer to your Windows 10 computer so that you can start printing to it and doing all those other fancy things that might be attached to it, like scanning and faxing, and also trying to rip a hole in space-time to access the Xenoverse dimension. So in order to get these added to your computer, you're going to want to go down to the start menu in the lower left hand corner and find this little gear down here. This accesses your computer's Windows settings, and we're looking for the big button here in the center that says devices. This handles your peripheral devices like mice, keyboards, printers, Bluetooth devices. And inside of here, you'll find a tab specifically listed as printers and scanners. And this will include a running list of everything that's currently connected to your computer via your network or via a cable. And a lot of these ones are actually included as kind of like a software thing with Windows. This includes things like being able to fax things from your computer, being able to convert to PDF right here, print to PDF. And if you have a piece of software on your computer that also offers this kind of functionality, it'll also appear in this list. What we want to do is add a printer or a scanner. We'll just click add and it'll start scanning for anything that's currently hooked up to our system. And right away, it's already found my HP OfficeJet Pro. Unfortunately, the main issue that I have with this printer is it doesn't want to talk to my other Wi-Fi that's faster and more powerful. So I have to connect to my slower Wi-Fi. So you have multiple Wi-Fi networks in your house for whatever reason. Let's say you have a combination modem and router that allows you to set it up, but you've actually got it connected to a bigger, stronger system. Then you might have to switch to a different Wi-Fi until you get that sorted out in order for this to show up. So for me, I'm just going to go ahead and click this and click add device that pops up. My computer is going to talk to the printer and be like, hey, would you like to be pals right now? Shouldn't take but more than a second unless there's something going on on your network. And then presto changeo, bingo bango, it's added to my device list. Sometimes if you have an older printer or an older scanner, you might have to go ahead and locate the drivers from the manufacturer. But for the most part, if it's able to connect to the Wi-Fi and you're not plugging in via cable to your computer, Windows should have a driver that takes care of most of the functionality for you. You might notice now that my printer doesn't actually have anything listed here. It says app available for this device. I can actually open the printer app that I downloaded from HP and I can get fancy additional functionality for it, like seeing if there's any additional ink that I need, if I'm running low on anything, or running low on paper. But now it's pretty much good to go and I can do all the fancy things that I want or I can click remove device in case I don't need it on this computer anymore. And that's basically the ins and outs of how to add stuff to your computer on Windows 10. I hope you found this helpful. If you have any questions or comments, leave those in the comment section below, and I will catch you next time. Bye, everybody. Have a good one. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time.